In a quaint African village embraced by lush landscapes, there lived a young girl named Adisa. Her early childhood was a tapestry of laughter and joy as she played with the other children from the village. At the tender age of five, her days were filled with innocent games near the crackling campfire, the sun painting the sky with hues of gold. Adisa, even as a child, was astonishingly beautiful. Her radiant smile could light up the darkest corners of the village, and her sparkling eyes reflected the purity of a soul untouched by the world. However, fate had a different plan for her. On one fateful day, while playing near the campfire, the joyous scene turned into a moment that would shape Adisa's life forever. The children gathered around the dancing flames, their faces illuminated by the firelight. Adisa, few led by the boundless energy of youth, joined the group, her eyes reflecting the sheer joy of childhood. As the children engaged in a lively game of tag near the flickering campfire, the village echoed with their laughter. In the midst of the game, Adisa, darting between her friends, stumbled over a small hidden rock. Unable to regain her balance, she found herself teetering on the edge of the campfire. The searing flames leaped towards her unsuspecting form, and with a helpless cry, she tumbled into the fire. The village fell silent as shock and fear gripped the onlookers. Adisa's parents, drawn by the collective gasp, rushed to the scene. With urgency fueled by parental instinct, they pulled their precious daughter from the flames. But the damage had been done. Adisa, marked by the scars that adorned her face, bore the physical remnants of that pivotal moment in her childhood. As Adisa matured, her radiant inner beauty clashed with the judgmental eyes of the villagers who couldn't see beyond the scars. Despite her numerous attempts to find love, each endeavor ended in heartbreak. The young men, blinded by societal expectations, turned away from Adisa, unable to recognize the kindness in her eyes or the warmth in her heart. One sunny afternoon, she approached a young man from the village square, her heart pounding with hope. With sincerity in her eyes, she poured her feelings into words, hoping that he would recognize the kindness and warmth that defined her. The young man, however, hesitated, glancing nervously at Adisa's scars before politely declining. Undeterred, Adisa smiled gracefully, concealing the sting of rejection. Her spirit unbroken, she continued her search, determined to find someone who could look beyond the surface. Another time during a village celebration, Adisa spotted a group of young men sharing laughter by the bonfire. Summoning courage, she approached them, joining in the merriment. As the night wore on, she shared stories, laughter, and dreams, hoping that one of them would see her for who she truly was. Yet as the embers flickered and the night grew darker, the young men dispersed, leaving Adisa standing alone in the fading warmth of the fire. Despite these setbacks, Adisa's unwavering spirit endured. Her parents, moved by love and concern, arranged a marriage for her with an older man known for his wisdom and kindness. Adisa, respecting her parents' wishes, entered into the union with hope that time might reveal the true beauty of her heart to her husband. The wedding day arrived, and the villagers observed in hushed silence as Adisa, veiled in humility, exchanged vows with her husband. Whispers of judgment lingered, but Adisa paid them no mind, choosing a path of acceptance and resilience. Her marriage, against the odds, blossomed into a haven of love, and Adisa became a source of strength for her family. As the years passed, Adisa gave birth to two children, a son and a daughter. The children inherited their mother's inner and outer beauty, possessing hearts and smiles as pure as crystal springs. The daughter, in particular, grew into a woman of extraordinary grace and charm. Her beauty, 
reminiscent of Adisa's own before the campfire incident began to shine with each passing day. Her features, untouched by the scars that had marked her mother's face, blossomed into a captivating elegance that enchanted the entire village. Yet, despite her external allure, the daughter remained humble and kind, inheriting the essence of her mother's resilient spirit. Fate, however, had a different plan for the daughter. One day, while attending a grand celebration in the village, she caught the eye of the prince of the kingdom. The prince, renowned for his discerning nature, recognized true beauty within Adisa's daughter. Mesmerized by her kindness and inner radiance, he sought her company, sparking a connection that surpassed societal norms. Their meeting was nothing short of magical. The prince, captivated by her beauty both inside and out, engaged her in conversations that ranged from the profound to the light-hearted. Adisa's daughter, initially hesitant, found herself drawn to the prince's genuine interest in her thoughts and dreams. As the night unfolded, they danced under the moonlit sky, their laughter echoing through the village square. In a quiet moment, the prince, gazing into her eyes, confessed the profound impact she had on him. He spoke of her resilience, beauty, and the kindness that radiated from within. The daughter, moved by his sincerity, felt an intense connection. The prince, recognizing the extraordinary woman before him, took her hand and asked her to be his bride. Their love story, marked by acceptance and understanding, became a beacon of hope for the entire village. The wedding, a celebration of love and unity, merged the traditions of the kingdom with the vibrant spirit of the African village. The bride, adorned in a dress that reflected the colors of the sunset, walked down the aisle, escorted by her proud mother, Adisa. As they exchanged vows, the prince spoke eloquently about the beauty that goes beyond the surface, emphasizing the importance of recognizing the worth within each individual. The ceremony, a testament to love's transformative power, resonated through the hills and valleys, leaving an indelible mark on the hearts of those who witnessed it. As their love story unfolded, Adisa's family found themselves elevated to a position of prominence and prosperity. The daughter's marriage to the prince brought newfound joy, dispelling the judgments that had plagued Adisa's life. Adisa's journey from the scars of her past to the joy of her daughter's union became a powerful testament to the importance of looking beyond appearances and embracing the inherent worth of every individual. The scars on her face, once a symbol of rejection, now symbolized a legacy of love, resilience, and acceptance that resonated through the entire kingdom, leaving an enduring lesson for generations to come. Till next time. Bye.